What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, bro. Hey, man, like, the entertainment industry is crashing right now, bro. Like, every, all of those big celebrities, famous, super mega famous, bro. The title of this one, Diddy brings evidence of how Jay-Z unalived his mistress to protect Beyonce. This is insane, bro. Y'all remember when we said Diddy is fighting tooth and nail to make sure he doesn't go down alone? Well, it looks like his plans are finally succeeding because he just brought undeniable evidence of how Jay-Z allegedly unalived his mistress, Kathy White, to I didn't even know he was, he was allegedly, married before. Kathy White got pregnant for Jay-Z and was threatening to do a tell-all interview about the affair around the same time Beyonce also announced that she was pregnant. And thinking of the absolute chaos Kathy's tell-all would be, Jay-Z made oh, the that obvious was, that was choice the and girl decided he cheated to delete with. his mistress. Sources are now saying Diddy has strong evidence that can prove everything that went down, so Jay's days as a free man might be counted. Y'all better get comfy because we are about to break this down. So, there has been a lot of noise about how Diddy is planning to expose all his partners in crime from back in the day now that the lawsuits are getting more serious. So, and every he's got to rat? Like one day closer to jail time. The latest update on Diddy supposedly ratting out everyone he has a history with is that he is exposing Jay-Z for unaliving his mistress, Kathy White, to protect Beyonce. If the name Kathy white does not this sound familiar insane. to you it's because someone somewhere did a very good job of scrubbing her off the internet and streets are saying that person is jay-z for those of y'all that don't know who kathy is that's well, a girl kathy he, white also he known as Corey, or coriana was a model and fitness expert who also ran her own pr firm mm -hmm. white label pr she used to hang around many celebrities and she was actually close with a number of them like claudia jordan and jason lee in fact claudia jordan who has been described as a known home wrecker used to join kathy white in in dating Holy married record. men and by that i mean stinking rich married men kathy herself is known to have admitted that she's here for a good time not a long time unless a man has a net worth of at least 50 million she won't pay him any attention so you can see how jay-z must have been the perfect match for her even though they supposedly started dating long before he and beyonce tied the knot rumors about the alleged affair between jay-z and kathy sparked after kathy and her bff claudia white were spotted at a las vegas nightclub partying with jay-z and diddy in fact Jay-Z allegedly okay. bought Kathy a $25,000 pair of Louis Vuitton shoes to wear that evening. Sources also okay. reported that Jay was very particular about keeping the relationship low-key, so he would do things like ask her to bring a couple of friends along for a ride so it wouldn't look like they were a thing, which is what he did that evening. While they were in Vegas, Jay also reportedly took Kathy on a trip to the Bellagio Casino, asking her to bring a few friends to their table. It looks like Jay was really taking care of Kathy, so much so that her friend, Claudia Jordan, was reportedly jealous of how Kathy always seemed to pull all the wealthier ballers and how she had over a hundred thousand dollars worth of bags and two hundred thousand dollars worth of shoes and how she could just randomly buy her friend a three thousand dollar Louis Vuitton bag so Jay was definitely bro. doing right by Kathy well hey. until he started seeing her bro, as a liability and that's why it's interesting that in 2020 a blind item the from Tracy Days and Knight said this A-list host model is crazy, also bro. an actress our host has always stayed queet about the death of her friend but has become more convinced over the years that the permanent a-list rapper had her friend killed it just seemed too convenient that he wanted her out of the picture and shortly after he said that the friend ended up dead it was then revealed that the a-list host was claudia jordan kathy's friend and the rapper was jay-z well as the saying goes this all is, that happens is... in the dark will eventually come to light it didn't take long for people to start <sighs> putting two and two together and figuring out that kathy was jay's mistress naturally they started reaching out to her for comments on the situation and about two weeks before she passed away a major tabloid that was investigating the jay-z connection allegedly reached out to her but and this next part is important kathy strongly denied all allegations of having an affair with jay i'm not even surprised given the lengths jay went to make sure things stayed exactly because you he can't you really can't that's why to her that bro that is why i'm saying if p diddy rat on on jay-z or or anyone that he's He's in alliance with, bro. He is he is digging a hole for himself because he's messing with powerful people with a lot of money that can easily, easily 
make him regret it, bro. Allegedly reached out to her. But, and this Easily. next part is important, Kathy strongly denied all allegations of having an affair with Jay. I'm not even surprised, given the lengths Jay went to make sure things stayed under wraps. He must have really made it clear to her that the moment she breathed a word about the affair to the public, the gig was up. But either Kathy finally got this tired of living a lie, or she figured that with a baby on the way, Jay-Z wouldn't dare leave her hanging. Either way, she decided it was finally time to tell her story, and she allegedly hit Jay up to tell him she was going public with the affair for a price. However, reports reaching us say that first responders to the scene felt her death was suspicious. Also, at the time the news of Kathy passing away from a brain pass? aneurysm got out, it was still too early to know for sure that that's what really happened. Besides, Kathy was young, fit, and healthy before she passed on. So her just randomly dropping dead from a brain aneurysm was just highly unlikely. A detective from the exactly. NYPD had this to say about her death. A 911 call from an apartment 130 West 19 Street in Manhattan. An ambulance came and took Kathy because she was sick. They took her to the Beth Israel Hospital and that's where she expired. It's too eerily to be speculating that an aneurysm offered her. They will be doing an autopsy later today to check out her cause of death. But someone might have given Kathy a bad drug, so they'll do a toxicology report and we'll have to wait two weeks for that report. What's okay. crazy is that the report never came through, and even though literally every detective and cop who worked on Kathy's case felt the circumstances were suspicious, her cause of death was still ruled as a brain aneurysm. Girl, it sounds like someone was out there pulling strings to get that there whole is. thing covered up. Money and people, this brings bro. us back to Jay-Z. Now check this out. Kathy passed away in early September of 2011. If y'all remember, this was also around the time that Beyonce announced her pregnancy with her and Jay's first child, Blue. The timing is definitely interesting, especially considering all the conspiracy theories we've heard, heard about Beyonce not actually being- I heard rumors about even Beyonce, bro, like crazy rumors too, bro. Like, like she ain't, she ain't. She ain't nice, bro. With her and Jay's first child, Blue. The timing is definitely interesting, especially considering all the conspiracy theories we've heard about Beyonce not actually being pregnant at the time, but instead having a surrogate carry her baby. Tabloids at the time started speculating that Jay might have had Kathy deleted because he didn't want the fallout from whatever story she would have told the blogs to affect his marriage with Beyonce. One blog even wrote that Kathy's death has stirred up some unwanted attention for Jay-Z with claims of a hidden love child in Trinidad and Tobago and Illuminati theorists claiming her what? death was a sacrifice for the famous couple. What's even more what? interesting is that all the renewed attention on this case was started by someone who also believes Jay had something to do with Kathy's death, Liz Crokin. Liz wrote an extensive report about the whole thing where she talked about how she reached out to Kathy for an interview about Jay-Z. According to her, Kathy initially denied knowing or ever interacting with Jay-Z until she pulled up pictures showing her hanging out with Jay and Puffy. At this point, Kathy mm -hmm. allegedly told Liz that she was would consider doing a tell-all about the affair. Then uh -huh. all of a sudden, Liz couldn't get through to Kathy again, and when she finally got a hold of one of her friends, she was, she was informed life. that Kathy was no more. Some of Liz Crokin's recent tweets yeah. about the situation actually brought new attention to the case. In one tweet, Liz said, As I said in a tweet the other day to Jay-Z, I was the reporter who talked to your alleged mistress right before she died, was murdered. I know everything. I know what you did. So go F yourself, Jay-Z. There will be justice for Kathy White. What's also interesting is that this, it looks hey, like Jason man. Lee might have been the one who originally spilled the tea about Kathy and Jay-Z's alleged affair because Hollywood Street King reported that their sources got their information from him. Suddenly, it all starts making sense how Jason could literally try and blackmail Queen Bay in front of the whole world. Did I tell y'all what I've done? No. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna tell them why Johnny puts a beep over this part of the show so you'll never know what it is, but I want you to see their reactions and I'm going to do it right now. Eh? All right, uh, that's insane. And that's where I go back to like 
we're friends in the game. We support each other. Yeah, Jason probably has information that would ruin Beyonce if it ever got out. As y'all know, a lot of the OG hip hop guys ran in the same circles back then and did a lot of shady things together. Apparently, while they were out there painting mm -hmm. the town red, Diddy was collecting audio and video recordings of all the shenanigans, both legal and illegal, and he's now ready to spill all the tea. In fact, some people are saying Diddy has already started speaking with authorities and Jay-Z might need to start preparing for the you know what just came to mind? What if Jay Z is trying to set up P Diddy to go to jail or go to prison because P Diddy, it, well, P Diddy had plans on going public with stuff Jay Z has done. So what if that's the issue? What if that's the case? the day of reckoning. Jaguar Wright recently said Diddy has released footage of Jay-Z and Beyonce at some of Diddy's infamous freak-off sessions. Diddy done turned over tapes, allegedly, with the Carters, in some freak-off, and the, and, and, the ba and the Beyonce, high on the cocaine, and the tapes had jizz all over it. Hold on. And now, Diddy is allegedly smokes. set to reveal all the dirty details of how Jay-Z unalived his mistress to protect his wife. And Diddy is not the only celebrity who feels the same way because Jaguar Wright once talked about how she believed Jay or Beyonce might have done the deed and then hired people to clean it up. Kathy White's life was taken unfairly. Well, hey. She actually died screaming. Hey, she she shouldn't have been messing with my, with the dog. The and the Carters are responsible. They should. She shouldn't. You but see, one of them, you play dirty. It's just a little more responsible than the other. You, you, you play dirty. You're gonna end up. Question with is, with dirt on your bro. Did Sean Carter delete his mistress, his pregnant, his pregnant mistress, because his wife was jealous? Or could it be possible? The wife did it. That maybe his wife's temper no. is just a little worse than most people think. And no. maybe he just had to clean it up to protect the brand. See? I've heard, I've heard anyway, that too. It seems like fans are happy that I've people that are too. finally talking about Kathy White and some have even compared it to Kim Porter's death. Yes, I've talked about this woman for years and it got swept under the rug. Now the light is shining. It's odd that Kim Porter died under similar circumstances. I believe all of this and that Bay profited from Jay's misdeeds. You can't no. outrun karma. But let me know what y'all think about this no. in the comment section below. Then check out this next video. Bro. No. The whole entertainment industry is going down in shambles right now, bro. There is so much coming out. There is so much coming out. And if you see the police are involved, if it's not all truth, it is very close. It's very cl houses being raided. It is very close, bro. And I'm telling you, by the end of 2024, I feel like there's going to be so much that's going to happen, bro. All of these celebrities that we're used to, we're fan of, will we'll purchase their, their merch and, and, and pay big money to go watch them perform, bro. Like, and, and watch even their movies because there's even actors in it. Actors and actresses singers and and rappers and 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 billionaires and millionaires there are so many people in this this whole drama thing going on right now bro like there's going to be a mayhem of celebrities bro i don't know what to think man let me know what y'all think about that in the comment section man i'll see y'all in the next video bro